First of all, uh, welcome to the MGM channel. I'm your host, Cornish. Unfortunately, I haven't got a webcam at the moment because, yeah, <laughs> as you can see, the webcam's finally died. So we're going to have to do no webcams. And today, I want to talk about more VR games. And so there's not a lot of Battle Royale games out there. Well, not any big major ones uh, until the Oculus Quest 2 came out and a lot more people are buying this in particular game called Population 1. Population 1 is a squad based battle royale game. You can climb, fly or even build like the old Fortnite. Let's not talk about... F no, no. But uh, yeah, you can climb, fly and build barricades or even structures to uh, get to places. When I say climb, you can climb literally anything in the game, which is absolutely amazing. There are a variety of different weapons, uh, from snipers to machine guns to submachine guns, shotguns and pistols. I got his attention in my ammo. Got one? I got him. Oop. Still one more. Should be guys. one more someplace. He's behind you! Got him. Cool. <laughs> there are many different types of skins in the game, so that's another cool feature they have on there. So it doesn't keep the game boring. Uh, the, the map's pretty big, however, it's only an 18-player Battle Royale game. But you'll be surprised of how quick the game uh, loads up, launches the different games, and uh, people start straight away. Takes a lot of getting used to, but it's really, really good fun. So let's start off with the weapons. Uh, the weapons are really, really interesting. They're really cool. There are some really cool looking weapons. And the way the weapon handles is actually pretty good. Uh, I was very surprised of when I ha uh, held the sniper rifle. <laughs> oh. Okay, it's us and them. Oh! Oh, I knocked one down! No way! Get out of it, man! <laughs> nice. Uh, the game itself, because of every VR, it has a built-in microphone, so you can hear anyone in the game, so there's no options to change it, which is cool. Um, keeps it more active, and players more talking to each other. Uh, the movement is really, really good, and taking out players ain't half too bad. If you've got a good squad and you've got a good team, of course, to heal yourself, there is food in the game and cans, just like any other generic battle royale. But uh, another cool feature: uh, if your player goes down, they can, and you're you both are quite far away from each other, they can get to you. Uh, no matter, oh, there's no time limit uh, to revive them. You actually have to legit use a defibrillator. Let's talk about the building uh, aspect of this. Uh, I'm, I don't want to drag Fortnite into this as much, but uh, you can build walls to barricade yourself. Uh, now, my only complaint for the game is there is a lot of getting used to. Now, my only complaint for this game is a few things. Number one, the movements and the buttons. I get confused quite a bit, uh, especially when I keep accidentally pulling up the map so many times. Uh, second thing is the sights could be a little bit better. Um, for an example, a holographic sight, um, when using the holographic sight, it's very hard to find that pinpoint or that little dot in the, uh, in the lens because it's not really bright. Which is a bit gutting. I feel like 18 players is a bit short for me and having it in squads only at the moment. There's no solos, which is gutting. I uh, would like to see a solo, that would be fun. Or duo. But it's still a good game. Just those few flaws. To anyone who's just got a VR headset, this would be a perfect game for you to uh, put in your collection. Currently in store, it's £23.79p. Uh, in US dollars, it's $32.14. Uh, that's not, not a bad price during the amount of fun you'll have. And every time you level up, you'll earn new uh, vanity item skins, weapon skins as well. And from what I'm looking at it right now, uh, I believe it's going to be one of those long-term games. And that is it for this video. I do hope you enjoyed this. Um, 
will be getting a new webcam very soon, don't you worry. Let me know in the comments if you've played this game and how many people you've taken out or just anything in general, what you think about this game. We have a Discord, so don't forget to check us out and come in and have a chat. We've got a huge amount of uh, community there and, and everyone's all happy and welcome, so feel free to jump in. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. We're doing very well now since this new starting of the MGN TV. And so far the feedback's been pretty cool. And I've appreciated every like feedback or criticism. It's absolutely wonderful. It helps me improve. You take care and have a wonderful day.